Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of T Forbes TV. Now you may be thinking to yourself, hmm, something's different here. And yes, you are correct. Uh, I am not sitting in my room talking to you guys. I decided uh, about 10 minutes ago, looking out my window, seeing this beautiful landscape. Um, well, not this office building, just the snow. Uh, I got a little sidetracked. Anyway, I decided to go for a walk, and I thought you guys could tag along to keep me company. I'm not sure um, how this is going to go, because usually, as you've seen, I do a lot of cuts in my video, and I can't really do that here, because you'll notice different scenery in the background, but I will give it a shot for you guys to try something new. I'm all about, uh, you know, innovation and, you know, doing something different. Uh, anyway, I think I got a little snow on the lens. Anyway, I gotta be more careful with that. Anyway, um, how are you guys? How you, how you doing? Uh, is it snowing where you are? Wherever you are. I don't know who really watches these videos, but uh, I love you. I love you guys. Whoever whoever it is that watch, you know, I appreciate it. Um, yeah, you know, we've had some pretty crazy weather where I am, uh, Burlington, Ontario, in that, like, it will snow, and it'll, like, snow a lot, and then it'll just stop. And then every like all the snow will melt, but it doesn't feel like it's gotten any warmer. So it'll stay just, like it keeps getting colder, but uh, the snow comes on and off. So I like to be out uh, when the snow is actually. A lot of people complain about it. I guess you know drivers and people that are you know working outside they complain. But I love the snow. I've always loved the snow, and I get disappointed when we have snowless summers like or of course we, we get a lot of snowless summers and I'm always disappointed no I mean snowless winters where uh you know it's not I can't remember the last time there was a like a series of snow days or and it, well you can tell like tell that's for school folk um but yeah it I'm, I like the snow it's always been fun of mine especially uh you know the first couple hours after it started snowing because you get scenes like like this, where it's uh, kind of nice and, I, I don't know if you could see that, I'm having trouble doing the hand and walking and carrying the camera thing, getting used to it. Either way, um, I love it when the snow has just kind of started out and it's nice and crisp and no one's walked on it yet, so I'm, I'm ruining this path here. But, uh, but um, it, it just, it looks more beautiful like that way, when it's all smooth and flat, rather than when there's, you know, people have shoveled and like done big piles of it or dirt and everything's got in it. Snow is just really, really beautiful. I don't know. I actually have never walked this path before, so I have no idea where I'm going. So you guys are going to be adventuring with me. Um, I haven't, uh, like I, I told you guys a couple videos ago, I only moved into this area uh, this past September. And I've spent most of my time uh, around where I go to school, McMaster University out in Hamilton. So I don't actually spend a whole lot of time around where I live. So I like to get out and just go for a walk sometimes when, when I'm in the mood. If this turns out well, I don't know if it will, but if it does, I may, I may do this again in the future. You guys let me know if you like it uh, down in the videos or post your comments or if you're like, no, stick to uh, sitting in your room where you can edit it and cut out all the ums and ahs and stuff like that. Uh, this looks like a pool. I will not be jumping in there. Um, I've done that in the past, not in a, in a pool, but in a, a lake in the winter, and then you get out and you get in a hot tub or a sauna or something like that. Um, it's not as fun as it would sound, and it doesn't sound all that fun, just so you know. <laughs> Actually, speaking of games like that, I got, you know, figure, why not? I'll share some funny stories with you. I was up uh, at my, my cousin's, or my aunt and uncle's chalet, I guess, up in uh, Collingwood. Uh, for those of you that don't know where that is, it's it's north of where I am. So it, it gets stronger winters, lots of skiing up there. Anyway, um, me, my cousin, and uh, a buddy of his, we were hanging out in the uh, hot tub, and it was snowing, and like, we, I don't know, we were, it was fun. Don't, don't ask, it was fun. Anyway, uh, they have a really, really long backyard, and it goes, like, a couple, it's, it's pretty far. <laughs> Why you gotta pressure me, pressure me with all these details? So, uh, we decided that it would be a fun game to uh, get out of the hot tub, run down to the fence at the other end, and then run back, and whoever got in first won. So, uh, me being an impressionable kid was like, yeah, this will be a lot of fun, like, it sounds good. Uh, so, we go, three, two, one, go, and like, we get up and we start running, and I notice that my cousin hasn't, uh, 
has to come with us. He actually went inside the house. And he comes back about a minute later with a paintball gun. Or a pellet gun or something. And he starts shooting off at, like, those of us that went running down to the fence. And so that, that really, all, winter games like that, like, where it can be fucking cold. Or freaking cold. I'll, I'll bleep that out. Whatever. Um, yeah, I, that kind of soured me on the whole idea. Now, I can go... Oh, there's a marina down there. I didn't know that was there. Like I said, I really don't know my area. Um, by the way, I think I'm going to head back now. My hands are getting kind of cold. Next time I may need to use gloves. But uh, thanks for watching. If you, if you like this, let me know. Um, click like, post a comment down uh, in the comments with your thoughts. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.